Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Oto 2 Plus 1. Now, I'm going to say this wrong. I think it's Shib Shibu Kuru. Anyway, I'll write down the number of this particular pen so you can check it out. The thing, and I'll include links in the description as well. A uh, couple of things about this pen. My first reaction is it feels very substantial. I mean, it feels like a solid pen. Now, based upon my rudimentary understanding of stickers, it looks like this one uh, has a retail price of about 2,000 yen. So you're looking at like probably in the 18 to 22 dollar range. This one, when I picked it up on Amazon, was about 17. And I gotta say, from the feel, I'm liking it. So let's see. It's got a, this feels like solid solid aluminum, and you have a kind of a grip down here. Well, let's see. Let's check things out. So, to start out with, it's um, a gravity selector. You push it in from the top, and then you release it from the clip. So, this is the O2 2 plus 1. And I'm going to make sure I get this number right. MF20KK3A. And then it's SHIBUKURO. So, Shibu Shibukuru? Mm, I don't know. So, you got that one. You got. Ooh. O two plus one and F two zero K three A. Ooh, I like the way the pen writes. It's rather red. So we have the O two two plus one M F two zero K three A Shibu Ooh, all right. I like this pen. It feels very substantial for an under twenty dollar multi pen. I mean, like really good. It feels really nice. I even forgive it for this the the little release thing here. Let's see. Do we have an eraser? Do we have an eraser? Let's just unscrew it. And just pull it off. Seem to have an eraser. Either that or I'm about to break a twenty dollar pen. Okay. So you got an eraser. This is a relatively substantial cap. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. So how do we get into it? Guessing we twist. Alright. That feels pretty nice. So I wonder what size refills it takes. Alright. So again, these are looking just like D1s. They don't strike me as being super off in size. I tell you what, I've been I'm pleasantly surprised about this pen. And at under 20 bucks, it feels like a much more expensive pen than a $17 multi pen. I'll tell you that. Kind of cool. I like it. I wasn't super, actually, looking at it online, I wasn't super hopeful, but when it came in and it felt as substantial as it feels, I'm pretty happy with this pen. This is not at all, but this doesn't seem like at all a bad pen. Anyway, let me know what y'all think. Have y'all tried this pen? Do you like it? You don't like it? I'm pretty impressed. It feels it feels like a solid I mean like it feels like a solid substantial pen. There's some weight to it. And the weight's well distributed as well. It's a little bit heavier toward the end, so it's it's comfortable in your hand. Anyway, I'll include a link in the description if you want to check it out. 
if you have enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope you all have an excellent day.